<laughs> Welcome yet again to another interview with one of the students from here at Kubis Aviation College. What's your name? Agaba Martina Spurs. Agaba Martina, I finally have somebody who is almost as tall as me. And the rest who are taller than me, but again, she's more light skinned than I am. And uh, most of all, she is in white. We finally have somebody in white. Congratulations, by the way. I want to officially congratulate you upon this milestone. Thank you so much. Yep. Um, so having said the congratulations and all that, I'm going to ask you the same question I've been asking the people that I hosted here. What does it take for one to graduate in such a position? First of all, tell us about the position because we have different colors right now. Yeah, for the white plus black, that's flight dispatch or flight operations. To become a flight operator, you go through school. You go through school, then you acquire your certificate. Later on, you do your internship. After your internship, you do your license exams, then you get a license, then you are licensed flight dispatcher. Oh, you're talking licenses and I'm feeling scared. I'm, I'm, I'm just holding a microphone. I'm nothing close to the airplane. So anyway, um, uh, so having said that, what exactly inspired you to decide to become, you know, this? Well, I realized my dream was to join aviation like later on, but when I was a kid, I always liked to see pilots. I was like, ah, I should be a pilot. So uh, my dad brought in the aviation thing and I was like, yeah, let's go for this because it's it's passion that keeps you actually in school. You have to have passion because things get tough, but once you have that passion, you're persistent and you make it. The passion, you're talking about when you were a kid, you were looking at aeroplane. So you're saying for me, I was looking at the microphone when I was a kid. No, me, I just want to make that happy kid in me who was young, who was like, I want to become a fellow. She's, I think she, she looks and she's like, yeah, we did it. Exactly. She's, she's not disappointed. Um, so what is it uh, that is so special about you? There's very many people that have dropped out of school. And uh, I want to know, what is it that has kept you in school and managed to become this that you are right now? Well, of course, as I said, it's passion. And aside from passion, I just want to thank my parents because they were able to pay the tuition. You know, without them and the tuition, this dream wouldn't have been possible. So it's because of my parents. They helped me, like, tuition-wise. And passion is what kept me even when things were hard. All right. Uh, she mentions parents. In the next segment, I'm definitely going to bring a parent in here to tell us the commitment that they give to this young people to make sure that they get to positions like this thank you for the interview roller 95 i'll be back shortly